I'm sorry. You probably just wanted a relaxing stroll. And here I am dumping all this heavy stuff on you. We don't mind. It's actually refreshing to see a different side of you. Great. Well, I appreciate your company, so please don't disappear just yet. I don't know whether you can tell, but... the years of suffering and loneliness aren't the only reason I have a hard time facing up to who I used to be. As I stand here by the ship, I can't get the images of the rising water out of my mind. One after another, people were taken by the water. All those treasured lives and memories washed out of existence in an instant. They thought their god would protect them. They had absolute faith that when disaster struck, a divine power would save them from harm. And all the while, I played my part to perfection to convince them that was true. But then the floodwaters finally came. And the Hydro Archon did nothing. You shouldn't look at it like that. You're only doing your duty. I've had to go through so many moments like that for the sake of protecting the truth. As time went on, it got harder and harder to bear. And I became more lonely and isolated. Eventually, I realized I had nothing left except the truth. I became terrified of completely failing in my task and was haunted by the thought of being left all alone, weeping on my throne. Fortunately, we were able to avoid the worst case scenario thanks to the help of heroic individuals such as yourselves. Everyone rose to their responsibilities and I finally regained my freedom. But, on some level, freedom also means no longer being needed. I have no further use to people. Hmm. Lima would have never imagined you'd see it that way. A reward? I guess so. And back then, I didn't even dare to dream about having someone to confide in. I was scared of someone recognizing me for who I truly was, and exposing the secret I swore to protect. Believe in the Farina you see on stage. She is the one you can trust. I had to keep all my feelings, all my curiosity about life to myself. No one could be allowed to know. That's what I really meant when I said I'm no good at maintaining relationships. So that's where you were coming from. Paimon totally thought you were just a bit of a diva at heart. <sighs> could you please get off my case? I don't know what's gotten into you today. I'm making an effort here. You could at least try to do the same. I do. I once had nothing but the truth, and now, I'm finally free to live my own life again. And even though I have no idea where I'm going right now, at least the choice is in my hands. Alright, it's about time to head back. Polo should have finished the ending by now. Sure! Okay, let's head back and check it out! 